Extract the files by double clicking the zip file. Go to Home, Movies, Motion Templates, Titles. Copy or drag the contents of the folder. Move the folder with the transitions to a folder called Transitions. Open Final Cut. Create a project. Set the frame rate to 30 frames per second. Go to Title and Generator's sidebar to take shots. Click on the shot twice or drag it to the timeline. You can increase the duration of the shot, it will not affect the fade in and fade out animation. If necessary, move or change the text by left clicking on it. Here you can find the exact settings for the text, alignment, font, text color, etc. You can also change the text in the option, source text. Reduce or increase the width of the line below the text. Change color. Add a media file below the bottom of the shot. If necessary, move the shot using position. Select your media file in the placeholder. Move the media file in the placeholder using position and scale. Add a media file below the bottom of the shot. Click on the shot twice or drag it to the timeline. In shots where there is media, the icons of social networks can be changed. Choose from the existing ones or by choosing your logo upload your own.
select your media file in the placeholder. Click on the shot twice or drag it to the timeline. Change color. In some shots, it is possible to change the position of objects and their animation. Combine several shots to create something new. Go to the Transitions browser. Drag the transition you want to the timeline. Change the speed at which the transition is played. Change color. To make changes, open a shot in Motion 5. If necessary, move the markers that open the animation of the shot. Drag the text along the timeline so that the appearance animation does not go beyond the marker. Dragging keyframes changes the animation speed. Select a setting and click the Publish button to make this setting appear in the menu.
Select Unpublish to remove the setting from the menu. Go to File, Save. 